How are you guys? This is IBU Learning, the place to develop your CAD BIM skills. Today video I am going to show you how you can use a steel connection in Revit. So here I am going to start, I will choose a structural template. So now I have a new file open, I will go to level 1 plan, and go to a structure, I will choose column, then I have already universal column. 305 UC 305 305 97 okay I will use by default same so this column in height level 2 so I place one column here I just copy another column around 4 meter I make another copy below also 6 meter this one so I have 4 column this column is showing only line so here I will go to change the detail level from coarse to fine now it's looking correct if I will go to 3D I will see I have column, four columns from elevation. This is from level one to two. Okay. So I will also again move to the level one. Okay, now I have to draw the beam, so I will go to level two. then I will start drawing the beam here also I have option but I will choose the by default now I will draw the beam from start to end from to here then this so I have now column and beam here I will change to find and now I will go to 3D. I will see here. I have column and beam. Okay. So now I will start providing connection. First, I will go to this is the steel. Here the connection. So I will go to setup first. Now I have a structural connection setting open. From here, I need to load here beam end to end connection, column beam connection. So this is group. Now here all connection. So what I will do now here I am just trying to load all connection because whatever uh, I need I can use ok so now all connection is loaded in connection uh, catalog so whenever I will uh, use that connection I can choose from there so now the next step what I will do I have to select column connecting to beam column and beam connection now I will move to a steel and I will click on the connection so it will show like this now from here I have to choose the connection type clip angle this is the connection now I will change the 
detail fine so i can see here like this is the connection it's showing here also i will go to connect the same or i can select this one i will create similar column then control select beam enter you can see this side also connected with the same connection now the next i will go to the level 1 plan here i will go to a structural tab i need to use footing for this column okay this size is bigger okay no problem now i will just go to place this one here here i can change the size i will make duplicate this is 600 by 600 by 450 i made one footing and i change the value here this is my footing and then i will copy this one multiple from center of the column to all column so I have four column with footing in the center of the column and then here center of the column okay now my column has column and beam connection here I want to put the base plate and bolt connection so again I will move to the steel then I will choose connection select the column and footing then enter I will go here and base plate you can select the base plate and it's created now we can see the base plate is having the bolt now for the modification you can double click or you can modify parameter from here after selection Now you can see the thickness of the plate is 25 mm. You can change from here. This is anchorage dimension. Here I will change. So this is the bolt location now okay like this you can modify bolt plates weld size is also this is fillet weld and this is all around so we have fillet weld all around the column with this plate now here also same you can modify go to modify you can see here number 4 number 4 is this length number 3 is this length so I need to change this one I'll change around 150 and here I can see like make the bigger this is the size of the, the thickness of the plate 10 mm and then length this length is 89 another length is 250 I just modify okay because and then a bolt parameter I want to go to change the bolt So here suppose I have three bolts with 
थे ओके फिफ्टी सेवन स्पेसिंग बैक मार्क फिफ्टी सेवन स्पेसिंग ये सेवेंटी सिक्स सो द बोल्ट इज लाइक दिस वन साइड बोल्ट इज वेल प्लेट इज वेल्डेड विद द विद द कॉलम एंड इट्स बोल्टिंग विद द बीम ओके सो लाइक दिस यू कैन ऑल्सो modify this plate also here on 150 and you can give here go horizontal bolt size to or you can change exact dimension as per your required dimension but i'm not going in that much detail to show what is the dimension required but 175 so here now this is looking good so like this you can use the steel connection in the corner now i can use the same create similar to this column Control B, enter. Same, create similar column, beam. Then this one also, or I can copy also. Suppose if I need to copy this, do Control Copy from here. I will go to level two, level two. And then I will find the connections. I will type C or copy command, and then I can copy from here to this way to here. and this is you can see you automatically adjusting this when you copy it's automatically adjusting on the side so this one i create similar before i'll delete this and then again the last one i copy from here from here you can see one connection is left another is top i copy from here same and then i need one connection bottom is left but rivet automatically adjusted as per my requirement so now this is rep 3d with connected all the connections now one more thing i need to be do i didn't copy this one so i will try to copy from here copy was all now i'll go to visibility graphy vg and vertical model i can switch off this so this all gone thanks for watching please subscribe for upcoming videos thank you